guys, it is 6, 647 in the morning. I wanted to get this part of the video up really quick before our day starts getting hectic because at 7 o'clock I wake up the kids and we start our day at school and whatnot. So I always start my day out pretty much with Shakeology and I do this because I wake up super hungry the second I wake up but I also have to run to 20 million different schools and do errands and then come home and do stuff around the house so I know that I don't have the time right off the bat to cook a meal so this holds me over it starts my day right it gets me energized it keeps me hydrated so that is what I start my day with I also thought I'd show you the kids stuff just because I've had a lot of requests to um, show what I feed the kids for lunch so for breakfast they also get Shakeology in their own little cup um, because again, they wake up, you know, we're out of the door by 7.30, so 7 o'clock I wake them up. They're not always hungry right when they wake up, so something like this works for them. So that's that. Now let me take the camera off the tripod and show you what their typical day of lunch looks well, like. Well, I switch this up every single day. I have tons of different foods that I switch up, give them different varieties, but these are some of the things they get pretty often. They enjoy the Yo Kids organic yogurt. I only get this brand. I don't get any other brand of yogurt. Um, I also only get this brand of juice, which is the Honest Kids Goodness Grape Juice. They like grape the most because it has the most flavor. They like these little cheese things. I don't know, mostly my son. My daughter's not too crazy about them. But then I have these little containers that keep their food cool through the day. And today, for the, I guess, main meal, they have these little roll-ups. I just put ham that I get from the deli and cheese that I get from the deli. And then I have today, they have deviled eggs in here. And then they have a fruit salad and that is what they get for lunch so I will be back around lunchtime to show you what my meal is for the day It is now 9.24 in the morning, and now I'm eating my official breakfast. At this time, I pretty much always have one of two things. I will either eat eggs with oatmeal and cherry tomatoes, which I know sounds disgusting and bizarre, and I thought that the first time I heard it, but then I had it, and it all made sense. And now that's pretty much my kind of go-to breakfast, but I got tired of oatmeal after a while, and when I am training really hard, when I'm doing things that are high intensity, kind of just harder workouts, I make sure that I eat something that is a little more, I guess, carb heavy in the beginning of my day. So I have been eating potatoes, red potatoes, with um, two fried eggs. And I don't add anything to the, to the potatoes except for a little bit of sea salt and some pepper. So I'm going to zoom in and kind of show you what it looks like. Alright, so this is what this breakfast looks like. Just like I said, it's just two eggs oops, and some potatoes. And really all I do is I cut the eggs open. And the reason I do that is so that the yolk kind of covers the potatoes, otherwise it can be a bit bland. So I do that and that is what I have for breakfast. I will Okay guys, it is 12.54 and I am officially having lunch. I just picked up my son from school and we had time together and did chores outside and whatnot. And now it's lunchtime. Now, I typically eat a relatively good sized lunch just because I from this point on, my day gets even crazier, really. Um, the kids come home and I'm kind of running after them and then we go and we swim at the pool or do exercise or whatever. My lunches are always really simple and part of that is because I live in a climate that is really, really, really hot. Like I'm burning up right now. Um, it's about 100 plus degrees today. so. It's really hot and I don't like to eat stuff that's heavy on the stomach. I don't like stuff like that anyways, um, but when it's hot, it's kind of magnetized. Basically, it's just cucumbers, cherry tomatoes, fresh parsley, um, I said cucumbers, avocado, 
red onion, red wine vinegar, and olive oil. I believe that is it, and pepper. So if you would like that recipe, you can see that on the website, or you, if you want me to, I could put that on the blog. And then I'm just having a side of fruit, which is a good amount of fruit because I love it, and because it tastes good, and it's hot, and it's nice and juicy in the heat. Here is a close-up shot. If you're wondering what this is on top, this is feta cheese. So I don't think I added that. I add that on top. So that is my lunch for the day. All right, guys. It is 5:09 in the afternoon. We will be going to the pool in about 50 minutes. So I am on to my second snack of the day, and I'm going to be eating a banana. Also, I wanted to mention really quick that water is so important. I go through about um, eight or nine of these a day. I drink a lot of water because water, like literally our body functions off of it. Our entire body, our organs, our skin, everything. This helps to keep me full. It helps keep me on track, keeps my body going, keeps you energized. You would be surprised what your body feels like when you wake up in the morning and the first thing that you do is drink a glass of water. It is a game changer. So. That's what I'm having. I'm not sure what I'm doing for dinner because the husband changed plans on me and he is now going out to eat with some friends. So I have no idea what I'll do here for me and the kids, but I'm sure I will keep you guys updated. So be on the lookout for that in the next clip. All right guys, it is 8.17 and we just got back from the pool about 30 minutes ago, which explains all of this going on, but this is very real life. This is what my day consists of, and um, this is how I eat around it. So dinner tonight is definitely not a healthy option. As I said earlier, my husband went out to eat, so I kind of cooked things that I knew the kids would eat because I figured I would basically just go and eat um, whatever I had in the fridge, like fruit and the stuff I had for lunch. But I ended up just getting a small plate, and basically what I had is just, it's just baked chicken that I um, put the breading on, um, corn, cream corn, potatoes, these are red potatoes, I cut them up, threw them in a little bit of olive oil, a little bit of sea salt, threw them in the oven, and homemade macaroni and cheese. So that is what I had for dinner, and the rest of the meals are what I had in my day, and that's pretty close to what I eat every single day. Really, the only thing that changes up a lot is dinner, I tend to, um, eat things that are a little more carb heavy or um, I eat a lot of fish for dinner. I eat a lot of chicken, uh, mainly fish, and I'll eat quinoa, sometimes rice, but I don't really like rice and always a vegetable. And that is pretty much it. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. Give it a thumbs up if you would like to see more of these and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.